Hey folks, excited to introduce you to a very exciting new feature from Epic Games, uh, WebXR Pixel Streaming. Just gonna show you a quick little experimental demo I have going here. Note this is not production ready, but it is a harbinger of exciting things to come. So what I've got is I took the Meerkat demo uh, made by Weta, a little free downloadable demo anyone can get. And all I've done is uh, set it up with a slightly modified spectator camera. I imported the VR template, but I did not enable OpenXR. In fact, I don't have any VR plugins enabled here. I enabled pixel streaming, I output it, I pulled the latest um, GitHub of the pixel streaming plugin, and I've just got a couple batch files here. This first one, all it does is run these two, and all these are doing is going deep into the pixel streaming uh, folder, structure in order to get the run local batch file. This is to run this locally, though of course it would also work in a cloud like turn or stun server configuration. And then the second one just launches with the necessary commands. And you'll notice there's a new one here, dash pixel streaming enable HMD dash VR. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna hit this, which will just launch both of those. Click to start, it's going to tell me that I have a couple different streamer settings. And on my desktop, I'm actually just going to use the spectator cam. And so you'll see we'll actually kind of have a, a co-op multiplayer thing going on here. So instead of default streamer, I'll choose spectator. And we'll see I've got a nice little view here of the, uh, the Meerkat demo streaming, uh, pixel streaming directly to my browser there. And now what I can do is in my headset, not connected to Steam VR or the Oculus runtime or anything like that. I'm actually just going to go to my IPv4 address. Um, don't worry about the default streamer setup though, you know, you'll get to that the same way through here. But you'll notice that we have this new little icon here for XR, WebXR in fact. So if I click this and I can see my hands doing all the standard kind of VR stuff, um, but mostly here, I'm just here to watch the show. I can see the spectator cam over there. Hello, it's looking at me. Yeah, that's me doing my thing. And I'm just gonna watch the, uh, the exciting little bit of action happening over here. So you can imagine what's exciting about this because now anyone from any browser, Chrome, Firefox, Safari, uh, on their phone, in their you know, Chromebook browser, inside their VR headset, would just be able to go to a single link. And if they have a VR headset, they can access the experience in VR, complete with everything that WebXR enables. And if they don't have a VR headset, then they can still interact with the scene, um, you know, through their computer. And I can continue to, you know, move around the spectator cam here and uh, fly around the scene. It's pretty cool. Try to get closer to the Meerkat. <laughs> so that's it for today. Just a very quick demo of uh, something new and experimental, but very exciting. and I'm really excited about it. <laughs> okay, thanks folks, bye-bye.